Hey y'all, welcome to channel Fresh Co. So today we'll be making this mopani worms. Um, some may call it amasonja. So the first thing you need to do is to soak your worms in hot water i use boiling water and i did that for about 30 minutes to get it soft and also make it easy to clean up so in my pan i am frying my onions in some olive oil and I've also decided to chop up some chilies with tomato just to prepare it for later on. So now I'm adding my worms into my caramelized fried onions. I am adding this and I will let this fry for about 10 minutes or even stretch it to 20. Um, it all depends on how you like them forgot to show you guys but at this stage i added some salt as well you can use any seasoning of your liking you can also use aramid I am adding one cup of water, it's cold water, to the worms. I'm gonna let that start boiling, and once the water is depleted, I'll add another cup. I will, you can add both cups all at once and let that boil away. It all depends on you. As long as you've used two cups um, to just get your worms a bit more softer and well done. Just before all the water has boiled away, I'm decided, I've decided to add my stock, my beef cube, to the mixture and I'll let that also get incorporated with the worms. Once all the water has been depleted, I am now adding my chili and tomatoes that I've prepared earlier on. You don't have to add the chili, but I always do, or I always do when I make this recipe because I like that extra kick also added some tomato paste i let the tomato fry and get well done and then i'm adding my exotic spice garlic and chili sauce that will totally elevate this recipe and as well as my sweet basil herb as you can see now at this stage my worms have and the tomatoes have reduced and everything seems to be well incorporated it's actually ready enjoy 